Three one on Jim Edmonds. And that oh. is called a strike and Edmonds cannot believe it. I don't know about that one. That was Edmonds body that spun around not his back. Bat never left his shoulder did it. And now Edmonds I believe has been thrown out of the game. Unbelievable. Third base coach Jose Akendo, bench coach Joe Patini out quickly to keep Edmonds away from Phil Cuzzy here. I, you know, every player knows what he can and cannot say to get thrown out of a game, but do you get kicked out of a postseason ball game? That's what I'm talking about when I said unbelievable. You cannot throw out a batter, barring something where he's bumping the umpire or really going over the line with two outs in the eighth inning of a one run game in the LCS. Especially Jim Edmonds. Well, it was obviously a, a bad pitch. I, I don't think there's any way you can confuse that for a strike as hard as Brad Ausmus tried to frame it. But the reality of the situation is, as a hitter, you're not allowed to argue balls and strikes. You can ask, is that as far as you're going to go? Is that the edge of your zone? You won't go any higher than that. You won't go any lower than that. But to just stand there and argue strikes with the home plate umpire. Well, he dropped one of the magic words you could read his lips on Phil Cousin. Well, Edmonds was called out on strikes back in the sixth inning on borderline pitches at best. Is, it, is there a chance he called that a called strike? I believe there is a chance. He's been calling that high strike all day today. And the, the pitch itself is not blatantly a ball. That's up and in. But Edmonds certainly didn't swing. And it doesn't look like Phil Cuzzy was pointing to the bat to say you swung the bat. I think he was calling a strike. That's a called strike. It's not that Edmonds swung his bat. I think Edmonds originally thought that's why he was calling a strike. 